case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In a 2016 case, Alexander v. Kujok, heard by the United States District Court for the Eastern District of California, six doctors and medical entities were sued for civil rights violations by deaf plaintiffs Kelly Alexander and Donald Porter. The plaintiffs argued that they were denied medical treatment and interpreting services, which violated the Americans with Disabilities Act of 1990, ADA, and other state laws, including California's Unruh Civil Rights Act, Disabled Persons Act, Bain Act and Common Law Negligence Claims, as well as the Rehabilitation Act. Under the ADA and Rehabilitation Act, doctors must provide auxiliary aids and services to ensure effective communication with deaf patients. However, the defendants contended that the plaintiffs lacked standing to pursue their claims, as they did not intend to seek further treatment. The court ultimately granted some motions to dismiss and denied others, depending on the claims and defendants involved, and examined factors such as the lack of treatment and interpreting services, defendants' arguments related to standing and federal financial assistance and various relevant facts. The court held that some plaintiffs' claims were valid and proceeded, while others were dismissed due to lack of standing. Defendants were not allowed to dismiss certain claims against them, and the court permitted some claims and dismissed others based on legal analysis and arguments. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.